Disclaimer on. This video is pure for education purpose only. Please do your own research. Hi everyone, come back with us on the PuCoin Research Channel. This time we will analyze the MetaPlanet coin. Is this legit or scam? Check this out. MetaPlanet's mission is to develop a full suite of professional DeFi applications and game fee sector. This token running on the Binance Smart Chain ecosystem. Maximum supply is, 10 billion supply. For now only available on PancakeSwap with BNB pairing. This token was created on January 5, 2022. This is their website page, there is an interesting animation at the beginning. Let's see. There are 7 main projects of them. MPL Swap, Exchange. MPL Tracks, NFT Box, Metaverse, MPL Social, and, MPL Dex. This is the MPL Swap, launch it this month, and they claim, it is cheap gas fees. MPL Tracks, allows beginner traders to trade derivatives on the crypto market. Launch soon. And, the MPL Dex, this is the most advanced DeFi trading platform on the market. If you don't know, it's like a Poo coin or Dextil platform. Let's try a demo of their game 5 for a while. Let's find a weapon first. Assault weapon, check. Let's shooting. Oh, there's an enemy at 12 o'clock, let's shooting. Ha, funny. You must try this game. Since its release, this token has been pumped up to 994%. Then down 66% from the all-time high price until this video was made. Swap Analysis Swap analysis results, there is no indication of a honeypot for now, but no guarantee for the future, because the contract is not renounced, developers can change the contents of the smart contract including disable selling, buy and sell tax is high, 12%, and from the 12% tax, the allocation for reward holders is only 1%, yeah that is small, but there is still passive income in this project. The holder analysis. Before entering the holder segment, let's analyze their distribution token first. This is their initial wallet. Send all supplies to this wallet, total, 10 billion tokens. 14% supply sending for provide sale. Correct. This transaction contains 84% token supply. Thirty point eight per cent supply is sent to Pancake Swap for liquidity. Correct. There are two hundred seven transactions in this wallet, and the remaining zero point eight per cent supply, equivalent to eight hundred million tokens. Forty five per cent distribution for pre sale is possible in this transaction. Current holder four thousand four hundred. The top holder only has two point nine per cent token supply. That's good. Holder analysis results. The top holder only has a supply below 3%, that means it is less likely to manipulate the market. The last, liquidity analysis. The current market cap is still low, around $850,000. Availability of liquidity, 487 BNB. This wallet contains 12.6% of total liquidity. This wallet gets a liquidity supply from taxes on every buying and selling transaction. The number will increase every day, it should be a lock soon. 86.6% .6 liquidity is already locked in pin lock. Come on check, how long have they been locked up? Eighty-six point six percent liquidity locked for one year, that's good. 
Liquidity analysis results. Availability of liquidity, it's safe. Locked liquidity, currently, only 86.6% of the total liquidity is locked. It is not enough to say it is safe. 12.6% of the tax wallet should be locked, as soon as possible. And, wallet owner not contains liquidity, it's good. If the Meta Planet market cap is equivalent to PancakeSwap, then the price of this token has the potential to increase to 1908 times its current price, or 10 cents per token. This price prediction is based on market cap and total supply. Alright. My conclusion. There are three pros and two cons to this project. The pros. First, in the future, this token use case will be large, because the project has many ecosystem chains, second, there are rewards for holders, and, the gaming project is real, you can try to play. For the cons. First, the lockdown liquidity is not safe enough, additional lockout is needed, and, the 12% tax is a problem if you are a short-term holder. That is my personal analysis of the MetaPlanet. The analysis I use is based on blockchain transaction data. If you have any requests and questions, comment below. See you on next analysis, goodbye.